this will be the last review of the Guardians of the Galaxy box set. If we're here, then I've reviewed all the other figures. I would appreciate it if you checked it out. But let's just focus on Rocket for right now. Rocket Raccoon. I love the design of this figure, but Hasbro really dropped the ball in the articulation. As I've heard before, the criticism about this figure is that it looks like a McDonald's toy. There's really just not much going on articulation-wise. And I know it's possible to articulate these legs. I've seen customizers do it. And they do it for a lot less, with a lot less resources. So they really need to step their game up on that. This will be the third or fourth time they've used this Rocket Raccoon mold for the same, you know, for Rocket Raccoon, of course. I think the first one, he was a Build-A-Figure. Uh, the second time they, I know they used it, it was for when you signed up for Marvel.com Comics. And I'm going to say this is the third time. So... But the fourth figure was, of course, with the Gardens of the Galaxy movie set that came out uh, end of last year with for the movie, of course. Um, that was not the same mold, though. That was the a different mold, and I actually like this mold better than that mold, but this one is a really cheap mold at the same time, so it's kind of weird. The main difference about this and the other molds is the face and how it looks. I'm pretty sure it's the fa same face sculpt. I could be wrong, but the paint is just way different on it. I do like this design. It is accurate to the comics. I like the way the suit looks here. It looks pretty well done. I like the buttons and everything. Turn on the lights. You see a little bit better. The red, the brown packets right here. That's another brown packets. Brown bags or whatever. Brown. His fanny packs. Uh, those are a different color on the other figures. I think some of them have them in black or a darker brown. And then we got his little feet down here. If you're going to make a figure that can just stand in one pose, just make it a PVC figure. And, you know, get a better mold out of it or get a better, you know, stance. But it's just, it doesn't work. I mean, if you can't have his tail up and have him stand, I just really just don't see the point. His, his feet can only go on this. And if his leg, his tail is not holding him up, then it's really just no point. Uh, people might argue, well, there's some other poses you can get. If he doesn't have his tail down, then you can, might not get some other poses or be able to get him on Groot's shoulder or anything I I would beg to differ I don't think if the tail I think if the tail was down like this all the time I don't think it would make that big of a difference the only articulation he supports is in his neck he can do a swivel it pops off a lot it's on a big fat joint same with the tail it can move around a lot but it just pops right off it's on such a fat joint most of the articulation lies in the shoulders he can go up that high he can do a 360 He's got a single jointed elbow here and no wrist articulation. I that was surprising. And uh, he has a waist swivel. That's about it. It's a pretty easy figure. I guess this one's better than the other rockets because he does come with the most guns. This is the same gun I think Agent Coulson had. And here's a gun that he has been been released with his with his other uh I'm gonna call his other releases. So this is the same gun that he's been having. I think this is the only newer gun. I'm not sure if this gun came out with any other figure. Probably has. I doubt they would have just made uh, this gun just for this figure. So we'll probably see it more if we haven't seen it already. Other than that, guys, I hope you guys have a great day. Uh, I know this box set's available on BBTS as of now. So check out the link in the description below if you missed out on the box set. It's a pretty amazing box set. Um, you get everything from truly amazing figures to kind of okay figures like this Rocket Raccoon. Uh, I love the Gamora, so just check out the box set if you'd like. Other than that, have a great day, and peace out.